2019 Ultimate Toys Luxury Mercedes Sprinter. What started life as a $50,000 3500 series dual wheel chassis Sprinter van has been completely transformed into the ultimate luxury mobile office, party bus, family van, and form of personal transportation. And it even comes with a three year bumper to bumper warranty. I'll be honest, when I first drove the $166,000 van back in Michigan a year ago, I wasn't quite sure what the point of it was. Sure, having ambient lighting, a ton of TVs and seating for 11 is cool, but what do you actually use the van for? Well, that's exactly why I drove all the way out to Cincinnati, Ohio to drive this Ultimate Toys Luxury Sprinter because I truly believe in a joint venture with Midwest Automotive, they've created a layout that makes all the sense in the world. I've got a link in the description below for you guys to find out more information on the van. And trust me, after you watch this video, you're going to want one. Outside, the Super Sprinter looks a lot like your typical 170 inch extended Sprinter, but it's actually hiding some seriously cool amenities. Sure, it's got a three liter turbo diesel engine and upgraded suspension, but check this out. With just the click of a button, a retractable awning opens up creating the perfect tailgating environment. There's even an exterior plug for a television so you can watch pregame TV shows. All you've got to do is set up some chairs and you're good to go. And if things get a little too messy, there's even an outdoor shower for your kids, dogs, or uncle who decided to have a little bit too much fun before the college football game even started. There's so much to talk about on this van. Let's work our way from the back to the front. So behind these massive doors, is actually a bathroom. Yes, that's right. However, unlike the Sprinter van I drove prior, this bathroom actually has plenty of size. That's because this is the only layout where the bathroom has been enlarged substantially. The reason that's really necessary is when the door is actually closer this way and you try to get in through the main cabin, there's actually not enough space really for you to get around the door and be comfortable in the bathroom. But now there is, this is actually a nice place to be. We've also got a microwave up here. We've got a refrigerator to store drinks. We even have a sink and even more than that, most sprinters don't come with a luggage compartment. This actually has a dedicated 34 cubic foot luggage space where you can set up a net right here and right here. That's more luggage space than a BMW M5 and an E63 combined. The inside is where things get truly spectacular. Midwest Automotive is known for their quality craftsmanship. I mean, look at this. We've got handcrafted, hand cut wood. You can custom tailor the interior exactly to your liking. Look at this massive ambient light right above your head. It's honestly like a Maybach version of an RV, except it's more practical because it's smaller. That means lower maintenance costs as well, easier to park, maneuver about, and it also means something really cool. It only costs $175,000. Now, don't get me wrong, 175 grand is a ton of money, but when you think about what you can get for that, that's 75 grand less than a Bentley Bentayga that only seats five. And even better than that, because Ultimate Toys wholesales these, you can get one for 40 to $50,000 less than that $175,000 MSRP. That is a good deal. So yeah, it's cheaper than a Mercedes S560, has a tailgating station, its own bathroom, it even has multiple television screens, internet, its own bar, swiveling captain's chairs, and two couches. Now my favorite part about this layout, and this was Ultimate Toys idea, is that there's no partition. The other $166,000 Sprinter van that I drove had a massive partition, but unfortunately, if you wanna use this as a family vehicle, that completely isolates mom and dad from the rest of the kids and the family in the back, making it not all that much fun for the person who's stuck driving. Sure, on some of the luxury Sprinters, you could hire a driver and potentially you wanna have your own privacy, but they even on some of the conversions have a removable partition. I think that's a better solution. The captain's chairs are extremely comfortable. They also look really nice as well. We've got diamond stitching. The leather is very soft to the touch and this black piping 
looks great as well. But the best part is that they swivel. Now, how is this useful? Well, let's say you want to participate in conversation with the people on the couches in the back that are drinking at the bar. You can do so. And then if you want to participate in conversation with the people driving, you simply swivel it around this way. But check this out. We've got a lever to the left here to recline the seat. So let's talk about the two custom couches in the rear. Well, a really unique element of the Ultimate Toys Super Sprinter is that the actual couch pillows extend out ahead of the base. These couches look more like something you'd find in a multi-million dollar home than an RV or a Sprinter. But the ultimate trick these couches have is that they actually fold out into a bed. Now there's two different ways of doing this. One, if let's say you're sitting in these seats here and you want a leg rest for whatever reason, you can pull out this couch like this and plop your feet up just like that. If you want to create a mega bed, you simply pull out this couch as well. And you are able to sleep in the back of your Sprinter van. Or if you're trying to party, there's also a bar. We've got tons of glasses here. One thing that really speaks to the quality of this Ultimate Toy Sprinter is just the attention to detail. So they've got these little felt pieces here on the inside so that when you rest the glasses down, they plop in quite nicely. I drove the Sprinter earlier, and despite the fact that there's so many additions, so many glasses, TVs, receivers, couches, chairs, there were zero squeaks and rattles. That's something that can't be said for a lot of new German luxury cars, let alone a massive Sprinter. What I would do seriously to be driven to all my reviews in this Sprinter van, because we have internet access, you can pull out your laptop, send emails, stream YouTube videos, and because of this interface here and the TV screens, you can even hook up a gaming console so you can play Forza or Fortnite. We've also got a bunch of controls here to turn on and off the lights. Let's go ahead and turn them off. So it's a little bit darker in here. Now this car doesn't actually have mobile shades. It's an extremely expensive option that for seven grand, do you really need shades that go up and down by themselves? You don't really. And especially because of how tinted these windows are, people can't see in whatsoever. There's also a standalone AC unit. It's super hot out today, yet it is ice cold in here. If you're standing up, moving around while the Sprinter is on the highway, you've even got these handles for support. But what's so impressive is how comfortable the leather is behind. They're also illuminated and clear. There's something satisfying about just holding onto these. We've also got a high-end JL audio system throughout the entire cabin if you want to blast some awesome music. But now I think it's time to actually take this Sprinter van for a spin. So what is the Ultimate Toys Luxury Sprinter actually like to drive? Well, surprisingly, it's pretty easy to maneuver. It actually doesn't feel all that much larger than driving a pretty decent sized pickup truck. It's not like driving a massive RV where you're worried about crashing into things and worried about the turning radius. It really just feels like a big truck on the road. And the suspension is exceptionally smooth. Rives over bumps very well in the back, especially on those comfortable seats. You don't feel any types of bumps whatsoever. The steering, obviously not the most responsive, but in a vehicle like this, that's exactly what you'd expect. 188 horsepower and 325 pound feet of torque out of the three liter turbo diesel engine. Acceleration, it's not breathtaking by any means, but it does get the job done. The fact that you can get all of these amenities for less than $150,000 is incredible. The fact that you can take your family on long road trips, travel the country, sleep, use the bathroom. Think about all the time saving that you'll do when you don't have to pull over at a gas station for every single person to go to the bathroom. You simply hop back there. It really is a do everything vehicle. Well, I think in order to properly end the review, I'm going to film the last segment while it's being driven and I'm in the back. Now, obviously the majority of the time you're going to be spending in the back of the Sprinter. So I thought I'd go for a little ride with my friend Matt Marcoux driving. What's really cool is because these seats are so comfortable, you get pushed slightly into them and it actually holds you in place even if you're not wearing a seatbelt. Now, if you want to walk around and get to the back, it actually is pretty stable in here. And the fact that you can stand up fully, I'm five foot 11 and not hit the roof 
is really impressive. Now I'm gonna switch from the couch to the captain's chair. I have absolutely enjoyed my time with the Ultimate Toys Sprinter van. The amount of options this offers and the amenities for the price is truly spectacular. What would you do with this? Honestly, everything from a mobile office to a luxury family traveling van to a personal transportation device, this does it all. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like always, please browse the channel and subscribe. I've got more information in the description below for how to buy one of these. If you're interested in one, make sure to mention that you saw it on Vehicle Virgins first. I look forward to seeing you next video.